Hello guys, again, Kopi Monokopi to the Leapers out there. My name is Jennifer, I'm a saxophone flute and piano teacher, and I decided to react to two Dimash songs this uh, today, so I'm gonna post one of them, you know, on a future date. Um, but anyways, uh, I just love Dimash, and I noticed my heart will go on on my sidebar, so I had to react to him. Uh, I wanted to hear him sing that because I love that song, and I've played it on saxophone and flute before. Uh, but anyway, he's just an amazing singer-songwriter, so please check out his page. All his information will be in the description, because uh, like I said in the last video, my end cards are kind of iffy right now. So <laughs> uh, just always check the description for the links to the artist and the video as well. Um, so here we go, guys. I'm excited.
That was incredible. I can't believe I've never seen that one before. I even looked on my page to make sure. <laughs> uh, Cause you know, I've been doing this for like two years now. So I try to double check my page to make sure I haven't seen something. And if I have seen something, then I always say, hey, I've seen this, you know, this is more of a review or whatever. I have not seen that one. And I remember not seeing that one. I'm just saying, I was just making sure. <laughs> uh, but what an amazing performance. Again, very emotional, very, very emotional. So I'm gonna post this one like Friday because I, I just did a Dimash song. But anyway, um, so emotional when he's saying that. It's like he could have been Jack Dawson singing it. And he probably was, you know, when he was performing that. Like he was thinking in his head probably, I don't know what he was thinking, I'm just guessing. but. Um, he was thinking in his head, maybe, hey, Jack would be singing it this emotional if it was him. And I, I could picture Dimash doing that because he probably, you know, watched the movie a bunch of times before he sang it, heard the song, listened to Celine do it. Um, and first of all, uh, let's talk about the beginning. I loved how lo low it started because um, obviously Celine starts it higher, um, but he started it out very low. And then he used his range, his vocal range, to get to the higher part in the middle. And that was just incredible. What a moving performance because of that. Um, and I loved how he had that little break where he goes, you're, you know, that part. Um, there was a little break and then the, the grand, I don't want to say finale. It's not a finale, but the, the middle part, um, kind of the climax. He just, what he did to that was amazing. I mean, it just really got me into it. And, you know, I was just expecting this, like, you know, similar to what Celine did or something, but he made it his own version and it was great. It was phenomenal um, is what it is. And with the dancers in the background and stuff, and then they had the picture of Rose in the back, like at the end of that, that was just incredible too. Um, it made me want to cry because um, I love that movie. Um, that's such a great Titanic movie. It really is. If you guys haven't seen it, it's, in it's incredible. Um, it it's such a great tribute to the Titanic. Um, but anyways, uh, I just love that song though. And he did a phenomenal job with it, just making it his own style. I love that. Um, and he, he didn't really copy Celine Dion at all. And, and I just, I just love his version of it. I really do. Um, I'm definitely gonna be listening to that again. I, I mean, not reacting again to it, but listening to it because it's really, really good. Um, he's just really good. And he just, the, his phrasing, he made his own phrasing. I love that about him. And he does that with songs a lot. Like he does that a lot with songs. And, um, you know, I, I love how he looks up to other artists like Celine Dion also and, and just kind of uses their material too. And I'm sure he had copyrights and everything, but I'm just saying like, he just made it his own and, and I hope she saw that. I really hope she saw that because um, she would be like, whoa, <laughs> um, I, I'm sure, you know, um, but he just, I just loved his, his pitches in that. Like he just used all his vocal range in that. Um, and that was just pretty incredible. So check out Dimash got Dimash. Oh my gosh. Sorry. <laughs> a tongue twister for a second there. Forgive me, please. Um, check out Dimash. He's amazing. And, um, Kofi Monokofi to the Leapers and really Dimash is just so good. You guys, he's just awesome. I'm going to leave that mistake in there because that could be one of my bloopers later. <laughs> um, <laughs> I, I, I have like blooper videos that I haven't posted. Maybe someday I should, <laughs> it would be pretty funny. Um, <laughs> Anyway, um, but Dimash is awesome. Seriously, check him out. And his information will be in the description as always um, because I can't do it in the other end cards. So thanks, guys, and I'll see you tomorrow.